FA International Airport French, Aéroport International de Tahiti FA IATA, PPT, ICAO, NTAA is in the commune municipality of FA, on the island of Tahiti, French Polynesia, France 5 km miles west-southwest from the town centre of Papite, the capital of French Polynesia. Tahiti is in the northwestern part of French Polynesia, and this is the only international airport in the overseas collectivity of the French Republic. It opened in 1960. Regional air carrier Air Tahiti and international air carrier Air Tahiti Nui both have their head offices located at the airport. Overview FA International Airport is relatively small. Air Tahiti has daily flights to most other islands in French Polynesia. There are international flights to Chile, mainland France, Japan, New Zealand and the United States. The airport is on Tahiti, which is an island among the Windward Islands, the eastern part of the Society Islands. Because of limited level terrain, rather than leveling large stretches of sloping agricultural land, the airport is built primarily on reclaimed land on the coral reef just offshore. The airport is operated by Settle Aeroports and has a single 3,420 meters (11,220 feet) runway that can accommodate aircraft up to Boeing 747 and Airbus A380 size. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Airlines and destinations. Topic. <laughs> Historical airline service Prior to the construction of the airport, Papeete was served by short Sandringham Bermuda flying boat seaplanes operated by Resso Arian Interinsular There was a connecting service via Bora Bora Airport to Los Angeles with an en route stop in Honolulu flown by Transports Arians Intercontinento which was serving Bora Bora in 1960 with Douglas DC-7 C propliners. Later the same year, following the opening of the new airport, Thai began serving Papeete directly with DC-7 C flights once a week on a round-trip routing of Noumea no, Nadi Nan, Papeete PPT, Honolulu HNL, Los Angeles LAX, US-based air carrier South Pacific Airlines was also serving Papeete in 1960, with weekly non-stop flights to Honolulu operated with Lockheed L-1049 Super Constellation propliners. By 1962, South Pacific was operating weekly non-stop Super Constellation service to Pago Pago in America Samoa in addition to its flights to Honolulu. Transports Aerians Intercontinento then introduced Douglas DC-8 jet service and in 1962 was operating non-stop DC-8 flights to Los Angeles, Honolulu and Nadi. The latter flight continued on to Noumea, with connecting DC-8 service being flown to Paris via Noumea in association with Air France via a number of intermediate stops en route. Thai subsequently merged with Union Aeromaritime de Transport in 1963 to form Union de Transports Aériens UTA, which in turn continued to serve Papeete with DC-8 jet flights. In 1964, UTA was operating non-stop DC-8 service to Los Angeles, Honolulu and Nadi as well as direct one-stop service to Noumea, with the flights to Los Angeles offering connecting service to and from Air France non-stop flights between LAX and Paris Orly Airport. By the mid-1960s, Pan American World Airways Pan Am was operating non-stop Boeing 707 jetliner flights to Los Angeles and Auckland, with direct one-stop service to San Francisco via Los Angeles and also direct to Honolulu via a stop at Pago Pago in American Samoa. Land Chile, the predecessor of LATAM Chile, introduced Douglas DC-6B propliner service between the airport and Santiago, Chile via a stop at Easter Island during the late 1960s, and by 1970 was operating Boeing 707 jet service from Santiago via Easter Island to Papeete, with direct connecting 707 service via its Santiago hub from Buenos Aires and Rio de Janeiro in South America as well as from Madrid, Paris and Frankfurt in Europe, also by 19. 1970, Union de Transports Aériens was operating all flights into the airport with long-range Douglas DC-862 jetliners. UTA then introduced McDonnell Douglas DC-1030 wide-body jet service between Papeete and Los Angeles during the mid-1970s. 
By 1979, UTA was operating all of its Papeete flights with DC-1030 jets, with non-stops to Los Angeles, Auckland and Naughty, and direct one-stop service to Sydney and Noumea as well as multi-stop service to Jakarta, Singapore, Bahrain and Paris Charles de Gaulle Airport. In 1983, UTA was operating Boeing 747 service into the airport in addition to its DC-1030 flights. The airport was previously served by several other international airlines, including AO OM French Airlines and Qantas, with flights not only to their respective home countries but also to Los Angeles. Air New Zealand has served Tahiti for many years and was operating Douglas DC-8 jet service in 1968 with a routing of Auckland, Papeete, Los Angeles. In 1983, Air New Zealand was operating direct one-stop, no change of plane Boeing 747 service twice a week between London Gatwick Airport and Papeete via Los Angeles. Air New Zealand currently operates non-stop Boeing 787-9 Dreamliner service several days a week between the airport and Auckland. According to the official airline guide OAG, by the 1980s and 1990s, major air carriers serving Papeete primarily operated wide-body jetliners such as the Boeing 747-100, 747-200, 747-300, 747-400, 767-300 or McDonnell Douglas DC-1030 on their flights. South Pacific Island Airways also served the airport during the early 1980s with non-stop Boeing 707 flights to Honolulu. Topic: Statistics. Topic: Traffic. Topic: Ground transportation. Many buses come into the airport from Papeete. The main bus being the airport shuttle, which goes along the Tahiti West Coast Freeway, which passes in front of the main terminal. The parking lot has traffic guards, in which 3,000 people pass through each month. Topic: Accidents and incidents. On 13 July 1973, Pan Am Flight 816, a Boeing 707, crashed into the sea just after takeoff. 78 of the 79 on board were killed. On 12 September 1993, Air France Flight 072, a Boeing 747-400 from Los Angeles to Papeete, ran off the runway on landing and into the reef at the end of the tarmac. The nose of the 747 was submerged in the water. There were no fatalities. On 24 December 2000, Hawaiian Airlines Flight 481, a DC-1010, overshot the runway on landing and slid off the tarmac during a bad storm. There was one minor injury and no fatalities. <laughs> <laughs> 